Hey, what's up, Hank Klinger? Day four or five, I don't remember. Um, anyway, only slept like an hour last night. Um, too much caffeine, I think. Body's still adjusting, so I had to take a nap today for like three hours. But this 30 day challenge is going to be awesome because I'm feeling really good about it today. And um, I think I got it down now for what I need to do to get through the day properly um, without too much caffeine. And my energy levels are starting to spike. And I tell it's a lot to do with what I eat. So it comes down to really healthy foods. Um, I encourage anybody to start getting up earlier for themselves so they can do more things like exercise and work on personal development without knocking into your day. Um, with this video, I wanted to talk about something. I recently posted a video and somebody had said something about a uh, resource-based economy. No offense to anybody, but Here's my view on the research-based economy versus a mon monetary economy. People, it's just like trying to change effects with effects. Like, you want a resource-based economy, well, people are still going to fight for it, just like they do for money. People are no different, like as a whole, as the individual. You can't change effects with effects. If you want to have a society where people aren't going to be fighting and struggling and stealing from each other, exchanging one resource for another resource, whether it's money for resources or whatever, isn't going to work. You got to change the cause. You got to break it down. You got to get deeper into the system and figure out why people are doing that and change the way that people act in their life. And so they take more responsibility. You can't just supplement some other system and think it's going to work like that. And I can't guarantee this, but I know from my own personal self and everybody else that I see that people who struggle with money and resources because they got a bad relationship with it inside of themselves. And they want to blame people who don't. And it's horseshit. Because money's not a bad thing, it's paper. How can you how can you label a piece of paper as evil? You know, that's like somebody who gets in a murder and stabs somebody and calling the knife evil, not the person. You know? It's not the the material that's doing it, it's the person behind it. Right? And if there was resources, the same people that are doing bad things for money would be doing bad things for the resources too. So that's my view on it. Everybody's got their own opinion. And I believe that people should just change their relationship with money and use it to do good. Because the more people that create it on their own terms instead of taking it from other people, and the more people that teach how to do it, you know, teach people how to make money and teach, inspire people how to create their own wealth and better their lives, the better it is for everybody. And it'll start a chain reaction which will better the entire economy and the entire population. You just can't give people things, man. People don't appreciate things when they're just giving them to them. You gotta teach people how to earn. They have a lot more respect for themselves and for it. It builds confidence and self-esteem on every level. So anyway, that's my view on that. It's a short video today because I gotta get back to work, but I appreciate all you guys. I love all you guys. Anybody who wants more information on how to work with me, you can connect with me on Facebook or Facebook at Hank Klinger or click the link below this video. Take care, guys.